Hello, my friends. Welcome back to my channel, Diamonds and Washi. My name is Katie, and if you're new here, hey, welcome. I hope you'll consider subscribing. And if you're back, as always, welcome back. I apologize in advance for the croakiness in my voice. I'm still recovering from a cold that my youngest so graciously shared with me and has just given me a total frog in my throat. So what we're doing today, if you couldn't guess from the pretty pile of packages here, is we're gonna be doing a small shop haul. Um, I like doing these small shop haul videos just as a chance to showcase some different small shops in the crafting community and um, hopefully let you guys know about some shops that might be worth checking out. As always, I will be sure to link to all of these in the description below. Please go and check them out. Support small business owners, especially going into the holidays. And of course, as always, a gentle reminder to be uh, patient and kind with your um, with our lovely small business owners. <laughs> so today, <clears throat> Today I have lots of pens for you, some Simply Gilded goodies, and some putty from Randa's Crafty Corner. So let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and start with our Simply Gilded washi. Let me shift this to the side. Let's get into these. So how are you guys doing today? I hope you're having a really nice day so far. I'm loving like the ridiculously shiny and amazing <laughs> metallic package. So I ordered this, um, it's been a couple of weeks. I'm just now having the chance to really get into it. And I think that this is from their holiday release. Look at how cute that is. And some of those I think are freebies. I'm just gonna double check my little invoice here. Oh no, that's right. Okay. Oh, I forgot about this. This is a fun surprise. So uh, back a few weeks ago, um, Simply Gilded did what they called grab bags. And um, so that means I don't know exactly what all is going to be in here, but I specifically picked the pastel holiday grab bag. So, oh my gosh, I love a good mystery, okay? <laughs> I'm so excited. So in here so far is, so there's this adorable pin Oh my gosh, that's adorable, an enamel pen. Um, and I could turn this into a minder if I wanted to. That's really cute, super, super cute. Cute little bear stickers, oh my gosh. And then a little freebie. They always include these sampler freebies. Ooh, it's so pretty. Oh, fun, the nice list cute oh i love that i love that gold foil and it's pink perfect <laughs> all right we have so much washi in here i am thrilled to have surprises to share with you all <laughs> and then i believe this is just going to be a journaling card it got a little bit bent but that's okay look how pretty Oh my gosh. So I'm finding ways to use these because I have a little bit of a collection of these at this point, but I'm finding ways to use them, like sticking them in with gifts and writing notes on them and that sort of thing. They can work kind of like a card. I don't even like the bag is pretty. Okay, so let's look at the washi itself and not leave us all in suspense, right? <laughs> Cute. So these are four separate rolls of washi. So pretty. So those are thin and those perforated. I can't totally tell. I love those colors. I am such a sucker for a muted pastel and a metallic. <laughs> love, 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 love. And then we have, ooh, okay. I was gonna say it's usually coming in a set. Look at that amazing, like aqua Tiffany blue. I love it. So I love that so, 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 so much. <laughs> Oh, you can't go wrong with a good, like, basic pastel. And then we have it in pink as well. I think I might have this one. But that is okay because that means I will just have to include it in some giveaway goodies at some point. So pretty. Love, love, love. And then these two. Oh, I love it. Oh, my gosh. These are so pretty. I love, love, love that pretty, like it's like a fair isle pattern a little bit. And then look at the bunnies and all the little like, 
all the little holiday things. Oh my gosh, yay! I'll have to use these on some of my wintry diamond painting kits this season. So yay, that was, again, that was the pastel holiday grab bag. She does these grab bags from time to time and they always sell out very, very quickly, it seems like. So I was like, I've never tried one of her grab bags before, I really wanna try it. So yay, Simply Gilded. So this next package, this is from Randa over at Randa's Crafty Corner. Randa has an Etsy shop with some different diamond painting accessories. And I feel like probably what she's most well known for at this point is her scented putty. I really, really, really love using scented putty in my um, multi-placers in particular. And Randa's is like, the perfect combination of everything. <laughs> it lasts for a really long time. The scent is not overpowering whatsoever. And um, yeah, she just, she has a great formula for it. So she does include instructions about how to load in your pen. Um, did I mention she also has a YouTube channel? So uh, I'll be sure to link to her uh, Instagram and her YouTube channel and whatnot below. But she restocks once a, about once a week and she does new scents from time to time. And I think this is one of the newer scents. I'm excited to get into it. Oh, oh my gosh, love it. Hamilton vibes, anyone? Love, love, love it. Also, that's adorable. And then candy, look at the sucker to Connor. <laughs> Maybe that peppermint for my throat right now, right? She always wraps it so cute. Look at that washi, so cute. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. All right, so this is in the scent, Vanilla Cupcake. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Like I said, it's nice that the scent is not overpowering, but it's nice. Like it's nice to have a, a putty that has a little bit of a scent to it. So she uses release paper so it doesn't stick. You get a little brick there. Oh my gosh, I wanna eat it. It smells like a vanilla cupcake. That smells so good. So um, she gave instructions, my way of doing it, <laughs> I don't even know if it's the same as what she instructs, uh, puts in her instructions, but I just pinch off a bit and roll it until it's a little bit thinner and then like kind of just shove it in my multi-placer. <laughs> I don't know, that's what works for me. But yay, be sure to go and check out her shop. Um, I picked up a couple of scents to give out as gifts as well because I really, really, really do love this scented putty. All right, the rest of what I have for you today is pens, entirely pens. I'm so Try to figure out from hearing my cat what is happening. <laughs> She's like, I'm gonna come down and take over what you're doing right now. Okay, washi, everything was fine. Okay, so this box, this is from Lazy River. I'm so excited. Um, I have struck out in a couple of their drops recently, uh, but I, I had my alarm set and I was ready for this one, you guys. So Lazy River, um, the the couple over there, Matt and Steph, are some of the sweetest and um, most generous people that you will ever, ever meet. And I love, love, love how they do their pens. So Matt pours some of his, I need scissors. What is wrong with me? Matt pours a lot of his own blanks, but he also uses blanks from other blank makers as well. And so there's always like a really, really nice like variety and um, he turns them in a variety of shapes. And I don't know, I love, love, love my Lazy River pens. They're easily my favorites in my collection. Yes, collection of pens. So I'm really excited to get to add, uh, to a snag to the one that I did from the drop this week. So we have, of course, Sticker and their Manatee which is like their mascot, I love it. I'll link to their Instagram and their shop below, of course. And Steph wrote like the sweetest note ever. <laughs> um, she said, I know, I'm, I'm not gonna read all of it, but she said, I hope this pen brings you so much joy in your Christmas loving heart. I know you love intricate pens and <laughs> I hope this one doesn't land you in the ER with the preparation. <laughs> That's a joke. Okay, um, I'm so grateful for Lazy River for bringing people like you into our lives. Oh, I can't, I'm gonna cry if I read all of this on camera, but um, yep. I adore you guys too. I absolutely 
adore you, Matt, Steph, and Aiden. Like I said, they're some of the nicest, nicest people ever. So, candy. Hi, choose. I feel like Lazy River is the reason I like really discovered and got into high choose, but all of the chewy things. Do I have to share with Connor? I probably will. Maybe. We'll see if they make it till morning. Look, the characteristic, of course, the manatee. And then Lazy River does their pens and tubes. They were the first ones to do their pens and tubes. Look, of course, I'm not gonna just leave it in there. Okay, when I saw this pen, I was like, I think I need that. That would match Little Helpers perfectly. Um, not only is it these amazing Christmas colors, it's a Christmas tree what okay I love it so much and Steph is totally was totally right in that note I love an intricately turned pen I don't know why <laughs> I love it but that's super comfortable to hold so this is not like getting in the way whatsoever but this is going to match that little helpers kit and like any other Christmas kits really that I work on perfectly I love these colors I love this turning I love it so, so, so much. Yay, thank you so much, Matt. Another pen, okay. All right, so speaking of Christmassy pens, I'm pretty sure that the one in here is also a Christmassy pen. And cut into it here. And this one is from a shop, I've ordered from them once before, but it's been, it's been a bit. Um, I kind of, I, I'm picky. I try to wait until there are pens that catch my eye. And as soon as I saw this one, it had sold out. Um, but I was like, oh my gosh, if they restock that one, I'm gonna jump on it. So this is from Stilos de Cobois in France. So they did put <laughs> a, a little note in here in both French and English. Um, so yeah, the the shipping wasn't terribly expensive or anything like that. But um, like I said, this is just my second pen that I've gotten from them. And also so perfect for the holiday season. Oh my gosh, are you ready? Do you see the sparkle? Look at that. Okay. Look at that, it's like a candy cane. Oh my gosh, my throat is a hot mess right now. Um, I love the sparkle, I love the colors, I love that it's like a candy cane and I have nothing like it in my collection. It's a little bit, just a tiny bit on the thicker side, but I really like the turning. I think that it, it suits that so, 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 so well. Love, love, love it. Yay, holiday pens, love it so much. All right, so these two, I have two more left, or two boxes, they each have pens, they're from different companies, and to be totally honest with you, I don't remember exactly what these pens <laughs> look like. This is what happens, this is what happens to me. So let me cut into this. Um, look, what happens is that I end up kind of saving up, like just, letting my packages pile up until I have enough that it makes sense for me to do a small shop haul. <laughs> and that means some of those packages sit there for just a little bit before I can actually get to um, getting into it. So this one is from, this is from Chroma Pens. That's right. I feel like Chroma Pens, I didn't cut into this all the way. I feel like Chroma Pens took a little bit of a break from making pens for a while. I think they put up an announcement about it, but I just am, um, entirely blanking on what the reason for that was, but I'm, sh you know, anytime a small shop owner has to take a break, I totally understand. Um, but I have one pen from them and I really like it. And so I thought I wanna try to snag another if I can. And if one catches my eye and this one did. So here is their business card and their info handcrafted in Minneapolis info about their pens on a sticker. Nerds, Connor will totally swipe those. And then I appreciate that there's packaged with so much care, handmade with love. And I feel like the Chr Chroma's pens sell out quickly as well. Really all of these shops. Um, Lazy River sells out lightning fast, lightning fast. And uh, Chroma seems to sell out as well. I follow them on Instagram and I'm signed up for 
uh, like post notifications because they post there when they restock their Etsy shop. So we're stuck. I don't want to. Okay. <gasps> Yay. All right. So one of my favorite color combos is pink and mint or pink and aqua. And when I saw this one and I remember I was like, oh, I haven't gotten to try another chroma pen. And this is totally my wheelhouse as far as colors go. Look at the sparkle in there. I love that. Again, it's a tiny, tiny, tiny bit on the thicker side, just a tiny bit, though not as, as thick as a lot of pens. Um, but that's so, so, so pretty. I love that. Yay, more pens. And then last but not least, this pen, this is from Pens by Maggie. And again, I have absolutely no idea which pen is in here, which one I picked up. Um, but Pens by Maggie, I have a couple of pens from them. And I just, I love pens, you guys. It's, I'll say it again because I feel like this has just become a thing that I say in my small shop haul videos now. But if you ever see a small shop haul video from me and there is not at least one pen, um, send help. That is my plea for help, apparently. Like, that means an imposter has taken over. <laughs> And it is no longer Katie at Diamonds and Washi. So I love pens. I can't. It's a problem. All right. So let me show you guys this real quick. But I like how pens by Maggie. Look how cute this packaging is with the colorful confetti. So it looks like there's a straightener in here. And there is uh, their business card, pens by Maggie. Like I said, I have a, a pen or two from them. And then I need to scratch this. What's on the scratcher? I need to find out. Cute sticker. And then I see, ooh, washi. Say what? Look at that. It's got some of the like confetti dust on it. I'll wipe it off. But yay, washi tape. Nice. Oh, my voice. I'm so sorry, you guys. Okay. And then also more nerds, more smart. These are like literally Connor's favorite, like smarties and nerds. So he's gonna be stoked. He's like, mommy, can you get more, more candy in the mail for me? <laughs> I'll make sure I didn't miss anything. Okay. This pen, super uh, well wrapped and everything. Okay, there was something about the colors and the textures in this that I could not resist. I could not resist. So this has like those blues and look at those flashes of green and purple. And I love like this mesh and netting effect. Again, I have nothing like this in my collection. And so I thought this is so pretty. I think I even had a kit or two in mind that I was like, that'll match that kit really well. So love, love, love it. Look at how, see, all these pens are totally different from one another. They all serve their own like legitimate purpose. <laughs> so anyway, my friends, that is it for this week's small shop haul. Again, I will be sure to link to all of these small shops down below, as well as their social media platforms, or if they have Facebook groups or anything like that, be sure to go and check that out and show these small shops some love. Let me know if you have any questions whatsoever. And of course, if you have any small shops that you would like for me to check out that I can support in making a purchase from, or if there's a place that you know you want to try out, but um, you don't necessarily know that you want to spend your money there yet, I'd be happy to test it out for you. <laughs> so um, you can always email me or leave that in the comments, whatever works for you. All right, my friends, I hope you're having a really, really wonderful day so far. Thank you to all of these small shop owners for creating amazing and beautiful products that we get to use with our crafting. Um, I hope you guys all have an amazing holiday season and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye.